Now, answering your questions about the law and legal issues. This is Legal Break with attorney Gary Bruce. Hello there and welcome. Welcome, Gary. Good morning. Good to see you again. Um, Much fixed. I know, right? <laughs> we have a couple of timely topics that we wanted to discuss today. And, okay. and one question has come up is how has, you know, 2020 changed the practice of your law firm? Well, good question. Uh, you know, it's changed everything in some respects, and then it's changed nothing because we're still dealing with people's uh, needs to be represented and, you know, and deal with the law. So uh, it's changed how we physically deal with things. We're not able to meet as much. We're using this mechanism, the Zoom more. We're using the phone more. But we've always tried to stay in touch with our clients and, and, and use these things. It's just we're not able to meet as much. We're still in the office by and large. If somebody gets sick, we send them home. But, you know, we're wearing masks here, except when, we're, when we are in our offices. So, you know, some of it's been inconvenient, but we've used it as an opportunity to review things and change some of the ways we do things. I'm a little concerned about when we get restarted, you know, but I think we're going to be ready to go. So it's been inconvenient, but it hadn't really changed what we do. And that is good to know as far as the law is concerned, right? Uh, yeah, the law hadn't changed. The law hadn't changed. <laughs> um, will we see another topic? And we'll, on that note, will we see trials again this year? Yeah, that's the big question. And uh, so there's been lots of discussion about that. One thing we've looked at is just saying well, instead of a jury trial, we're happy to have the judge decide a case, you know, just to move it along. We need to. We're getting pushed back, though, believe it or not. The insurance companies now are all of a sudden worried about their constitutional right to a jury trial, which they never <laughs> believed in before. But that's the problem. That's the holdup. Wow. So we're seeing, um, you know, that's going to be a long time, I think. Harris County actually has set a docket call for mid-September. I don't know what's going to happen there. I don't guess anybody really does. Maybe by the time this airs it, we will. But you know, we're trying to move cases along. I think bench trials will be the first mechanism to do it. Mm -hmm. They're much more efficient. They're easier to do, and you don't have to have as many people involved. And we're looking at six-person juries. That's certainly an issue. A 12-person jury sitting and hearing a case. I don't know that we're going to have that this month or next month, or, and I'm not sure when we'll have that. So uh, there, all are, there are alternatives, and um, bench trials being one of them, I think we're going to have to see more use of. Hopefully we can. Oh, very good. So things will get moving along. Thank you so much, Gary, for answering the questions today. And we'll see you on the very next legal break.